Hello everyone, this is Valences Balsevichus from AJA CAD and today I'll show you how to use our wall reinforcement tool to create dowel bars and place them automatically on the top of precast walls. So I'll start by creating rebar configuration. Here I'll just create new configuration, give it a new name, dowel bars. Then I'll go to this tab and here I have different options how to create selected shape of rebar. So I will click on new item and this is just a row of parameters which I can describe to place my selected shape of reinforcement. I can have two lines here if I want but one is enough in this case. Then I pick the side where it should be located so in this case it will be on the top. Here if I have some cutouts at my wall I can define some limitations if my bar should be created or not. Then I pick the rebar shape, in this case it will be straight because I want to create this shape. So I select the size of the rebar. Then I will not use bar length because I need just extended anchor distance. So I'm just going to modify these. Then for the position of a rebar I will choose this parameter so it will be the distance from external side of the wall end cover is a distance to the wall boundary if it will intersect with my bar but in this case that's not gonna happen I also need to define layout direction so I'll choose just center it then any big number of rebars uh, if more of these will be created, they will be deleted. Then spacing distance between my dial bars and then some offsets from the start and the end of the wall. And I don't need any hooks in this case. Uh, another thing what I want to do, I want to set solid of these elements so just for better visibility. So I'm gonna save it, save and close, select wall and link that configuration to the wall type. So I have many wall types in this project. That one is selected and I will assign configuration to it. So I'll click on OK, select other walls as well, click create rebar and all of the rebars will be distributed on top of my wall. If I'm going to work on my configuration a little bit more then let me show you the result I can achieve. So I already modified my configuration, click on create rebar and then this is the result. And you can see I have U-shaped bars extended at the edges of the wall, I have diagonal bars around opening, I have some additional bars on the top of my wall and my openings. So this is one of the possible examples but if you need more you can watch our webinar subscribe to our youtube channel subscribe to our newsletters visit our web page to find more information get the two weeks trial of the tool but that's it for today and see you next time bye aga gad building bim together